everybody, John the Phone Guy here, and welcome to Invicta Specs Ladies Edition, sponsored by Smitten by Invicta. This is going to be a new series I'm working on to highlight the Invicta Ladies Collections, and primarily uh, my wife's collection, Smitten by Invicta. And today, with the first one, we're going to introduce the Sabaquanoma One Slim Case uh, Diamond Version. And with that, let's uh, jump over to the bench and take a closer look at this. Hey everybody, here we are on the bench and uh, I really need to give a, a major shout out to my wife Smitten by Invicta who has gone through and redesigned my set, so to speak. Um, Featuring some of the uh, Invicta cases and, you know, how um, to display and, and show this. And, of course, one to mention, she uh, put all this pairing together with this uh, B bracelet, um, matching it up to the watch and everything. So just wanted to give a shout out and a big thank you to her for that. So with that, let's uh, pull this off the off the cushion and we'll uh, set this guy. Well, let's see. We'll set it, set it over there so we can still see it. So with that, this is the women's Sabaquanoma 1. This is model 28558. This has a white mother pearl on the dial. It's a 38 millimeter flame fusion. Uh, the movement is a TMI VH 68 quartz it's a two joule movement. Uh, it takes battery as an SR920SW. About two years uh, battery life on that guy. Uh, the water resistance is 10 atmosphere, 100 meters, 330 feet. Uh, probably more primarily because this is not a screw down crown. Uh, the uh, diamond color on this is H to I and grade is I2 to I3. And with that, let's just kind of get right into this thing and take a look. So we've got some real, some real details here. Of course, you know, with the mother of pearl, uh, the the light, and let's see if we can't get some good color here. There's some peach and some blue, and of course the diamonds. Uh, you have the uh, all of this uh, purple, and then you've got your rose tone and the stainless on this bracelet. Uh, I did do a video, if not on this specific model, on the Sabakwa Noma um, One Slim Case. Uh, this is a double screw, so you need two screwdrivers to adjust the links. Uh, this is a butterfly um, pressure style, so you have to uh, press it in uh, and it it connects right there and on here for the uh, for the connection so I will say um, this is probably a fingernail killer for you ladies out there uh, I do uh, prefer the dual deployment that has the uh, releases here uh, but this this will uh, stay secure on your wrist I, I like that they've um, color and ionized the uh, bracelet all the way through and of course on the back we've got all of the uh, the details here of the uh, sabaqua and stainless steel uh, the diamonds and the model number and all of that of course you can see on the inside uh, we have this uh, blue cabochon right here uh, this is a fixed bezel uh, for anyone's looking at this. And of course, with the Sabaquanoma 1, you get this uh, T bar uh, lug and the, um, the donut shape. What I really love about this is how accommodating for different size wrists because of this uh, free flowing articulation here. And of course, we've got your um, day of the week. Sorry, let me grab my uh, my pointer here. So we've got the, the day of the week over here. 
we've got your 24 hour scale and the date and of course this is a standard you know three hand movement outside of that uh, you do have diamonds at the hour markers and then two rows of diamonds on the outside on the bezel um, so with that let's uh, as always let's go take a look at the uh, at this watch under the microscope and uh, really dive into the dial so here we are under the microscope with the uh, Sabakwa Noma 1 ladies and to look at just how amazing the mother of pearl on this is I'm going to zoom in a little bit more here and just look at the the details of this sorry let me get focused in here real good um, and just take a look at this I mean it's just very amazing the the the, the detail and the work as you can see let's see if I can uh, Oops, I moved it out of the shot. My apologies. Um, you can see the uh, the diamonds here. I'm going to try and turn on a light on my scope and see if that helps illuminate this. And let's uh, see what we can get zoomed in and focused on those diamonds. So you can you can see. Whoop. So we can see the. Uh, Where'd it go? Lost the light. There we go. Um, so we can see just how um, how bright this is, and um, I apologize for trying to get this uh, too much, but you can see the the prong sets on here, and all of the diamonds, and of course the uh, the coloration on the mother of pearl. If I can get that to just kind of you can see the uh, the structure here and of course you've got all the uh, the rose tone accents and all that let's uh, kind of pan out here for a little bit get an overall view there we got just a, an amazing all that color uh, with the light of course we've got our constant running seconds over here at the uh, at the three o'clock and of course we've got our 24 hour uh, scale and then the day of the week is over here at the 10 o'clock um, but again just some of the details of the mother of pearl and all the color is just amazing uh, and of course we can't go without talking about the coloration on the bracelet you have the blue and then you've got the stainless and then the the rose gold here and uh, let me see if I can get focused in on that cabochon on the on the crown right there um, you know just a beautiful accent to this piece and, and everything about it of course you know we can look at case back and and all of that to uh, to see in detail but just some of the amazing uh, craftsmanship on this watch it really is uh, second to none I me mean, uh, turn this off a little bit get the get some more ambient light to try and work with so there we go uh, and of course you can even see down here at the hour markers you've got little um, you got diamonds here on your hour markers you've got some luminescent on the uh, minute hour and the sweep hand on the second so just uh, an, an amazing um, dial and uh, just a really beautiful all, all the work that was put into it of course we've got the purples on the case and you got the the donut shape with all of that um, and of course you know don't want to forget about the the diamonds and you know they they really are uh, spectacular so with that I don't want to belabor the point but I, I really want to illustrate just how amazing that that mother of pearl is and and how uh, how much color change that you get from it so 
with that, let's uh, jump back to the bench and finish this thing off. All right, and here we are back from the microscope. So that was just, you know, some, some really uh, beautiful look. And, of course, you, you can get all the, the shine off of that and everything. But without any further ado, let's get some specs on this guy. So 10 to 4, I get 38. And the thickness on this case, I get 12. Uh, let's measure the lug right here at the screws. So I get 26.2. The bracelet width is 18.1. The thickness on these links is 3.7. And I'm going to measure the width across here. And I'm going to go right in the middle of these screws right here. So I get 41.1. Um, so with that, let's set this guy over here and grab our scale. And let's take some weight on this thing. So we're in grams. So I get 129 grams on this. And of course, uh, this watch has been sized for my wife. So obviously, you know, with some other links, it may vary a little bit. Uh, the ounces is 4.5. So, you know, it's not a, a, a very heavy watch. But I think it has an, enough weight that you really feel the, uh, the sensation of having a good quality watch on your wrist. And of course, you know, you can see, we'll pop this guy back together and everything. But uh, with that, um, let, me, uh, let me put this back on here so we can kind of see it with the, uh, with the bead and the bracelet. So there we go, all together and uh, looking amazing I must say so with that let's uh, give a few shout outs to obviously uh, smitten by Invicta on Instagram and some of the our friends on uh, YouTube and we'll give a shout out to smitten by Invicta on Instagram uh, Invicta watches and women's fashion and of course uh, YouTube sensations Trap Vision 3D and the lifestyle page talking about all things collecting and family. And of course, Tommy Big Time uh, focusing on uh, bracelet sizing and battery changes and everything Invicta. Of course, Meet and I uh, journaling their weight loss surgery and entrepreneurship. And of course, uh, D&Q uh, chronicling travel and food and fun. Tony Wo, uh, Christian rapper and his music and life perspective. And of course, uh, I wanna give a shout out to Unboxed Sneaks. Uh, has a great uh, show illustrating uh, men's um, sneakers and the uh, lifestyle and fashion that goes with it. And always uh, wanna mention Shop HQ Bulldog Shopping Network and Invicta Stores is where we do the vast majority of our shopping. Uh, we have gone through Amazon, obviously, and eBay. Uh, with any of those sites, I always say, you know, do your due diligence to make sure that it's a, uh, you know, a reputable uh, company and everything. And obviously, with um, Facebook, there are just a tremendous amount. I know there's a, an Invicta uh, girl group and, you know, uh, Invicta vets, uh, Invicta Cruisers, 757, and on and on. Flossing, there's just so many. Um, so to, I don't want to try and miss anyone, but it's just a, a, a great environment out there. Uh, find something that you can associate with and that seems to fit your style and uh, rock on with it and enjoy everybody. So with that, let me... Uh, pause here and I will see you in a second to finish out this video. And hey everyone, just wanted to uh, take a moment at the end here and uh, thank everybody for watching. Uh, I hope this has been um, fun and informative and something a little different. Uh, I, I really want to, you know, highlight um, Invicta women's watches. Uh, I know, you know, the vast majority uh, our, you know, men's watches and everything. And I think sometimes, unfortunately, 
the ladies um, get left out from time to time but I do want to make note that there are some some really nice watches uh, available so I just wanted to uh, start highlighting some of those and of course you know we've got this uh, this beauty that we just went through and uh, and took a look at so with that if um, if you enjoyed this and you haven't subscribed please hit the subscribe button over here uh, and uh, I'm also going to include some uh, video links to some other playlist uh, to uh, take a look at as well and with that I say enjoy your Invicta timepieces and I hope to see you next time on Invicta Specs Lady Edition. Thank you.